Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh uh, My name is Rizik Indramal Malik I'm from class A Syariah Economy uh, I want to present my English essay With the title The Mushrooming of Conventional Bank And to chase Okay The first material is The difference between conventional banks and Islamic banks. As we have known, that Islamic banks are banks that carry out business activities based on Sharia principles or Islamic legal principles regulated in the fatwa of the Indonesian Ulama Council, such as the principle of justice and balance, adil wa talizun, benefit or maslaha, universalism, or natural and do not contain goror, maizil, usury, unjust, and unflaw of tech. Then conventional banks are banks that carry out conventional business are activities which in their activities provide service in payment traffic based on established procedures and provisions. The next is advantages and disadvantages of conventional banks. Advantages of conventional banks. The first is conventional banks are more diverse. This diversity exists because conventional banks that apply this interest system are always diverse in creating their products. So that conventional banks are in great demand by the public the second is the interest method has been widely known by the public conventional banks are apply the interest system this in the system is widely known in the community in indonesia next the weakness or disadvantages of conventional banks the first is interest system that is forbidden in Indonesia. As a country with a majority Muslim population, of course, the Indonesian people know that the interest system is forbidden by Islam. This is indeed a drawback for conventional banks. The second is such a big interest. This makes conventional banks have quite a few shortcomings that are considered by the public when using conventional banks because the interest percentage is quite large the next is why do you prefer conventional banks over islamic banks in this case islamic banks are actually easily accepted by the wider community in indonesia However, the lack of good socialization from various types of Islamic banks has caused conventional banks to be better known by the wider community. Thus, the public understands and is more familiar with conventional banks as a whole. The next is solution so that fans of conventional banks are Islamic banks are even leading distribute in the high price issued by Islamic banks product my consumers sometimes well can to choose Islamic banks are the financy of place Islamic banks must be more efficient in technology so that they can reduce operational costs that are more competitive in addition it takes a lot of literacy for the community about Islamic banks so that people can assess how Islamic banks are when they become their main savings account. Okay, and then the last the summary conventional banks are those that use conventional system in carry out their activities. Conventional banks are banks that are quite in demand by the public in Indonesia because people are already familiar with the interest system in conventional bank activities. 
Okay, thank you for nice attention and plus, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.